Hanukkah, if I want to give all honor and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Racha, Hakkadash, Lalam Yam. Who Yahweh be the true name of the Heavenly Father, who the world he calls God. And Yahweh Shai be the true name of the Lord and Savior of the nation of Israel, who the world eagerly calls Jesus Christ. I'm going to give double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who teach me about these last days and who are the true leaders of the nation of Israel. Whether you receive it or not, we come to 100% truth. And also say peace and blessings to the Lord's elect. All right, this is Brother Michal. Come back at you with a quick in transit lessons of the Spirit by Yahweh Bashmi Ashai, representing the Cleveland Branch of Great Millstone. I want to say to all Yahweh Bashmi Ashai, if you give me spirit through this lesson. And uh, the title of this lesson will be uh, the, the Loosening of the Seven Seals or some, something to that nature. All right, the loosening of the seven seals. <laughs> All right, now, you know, this is important. Uh, when you read uh, uh, Revelation, the fifth chapter, um, you know, the the, uh, you know, the angel is, is asked, uh, asked who's worthy to open, uh, to, to, uh, open the book and, and loosen the seals. You know, and in the, in, in the fifth verse, it says that the uh, the line of the tribe of Judah, which is Yahweh Shai, uh, has loosened the seals for us. It's worthy to loosen the seals. And with that loosening of the seals came what the, and the understanding, okay? Because these seven seals are uh, were, were uh, holding the uh, you know the understanding, the full understanding back. Okay, so with the death of Yahweh Shai. He was what? Able to send the comforter down. Uh, you know, you can read about that in John the 14th chapter. Uh, to send the comforter down. Okay? And he explains why in the 14th chapter. That he had to, that he had to die so that the comforter could be sent. Alright, this, this is all to the mercy of the Lord. So now with, with the death of Yahweh Shai and him loosening uh, the seals, now we have an understanding of, of what's going on. Now we have an understanding and we're, we're able to decipher what the prophets uh, were saying, right? The dark sayings that they were, uh, uh, you know, um, uh, writing down, right? The uh, the mysteries of the scriptures, you know, the breakdowns and the understanding. Those things came with, with the death of Yahweh Shah. Because he had to do certain things before the, uh, he could send uh, the, the, the Spirit, the Holy Spirit, down to his men to, to be able to uh, to receive the the, the full 100% uh, 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 understanding according to salvation. Okay, 100% knowledge. Okay, so there's a 100% uh, uh, doctrine out here, man. And with the loosening of the seals, that's what Yahweh Shah gave us, is the understanding. So that, that, so that way his men would, would know uh, what to do uh, in that time. Right? So, you know, we, uh, you know, we just make sure that we thank Yahweh Shah for that, for that, for uh, that, you know, for that for that understanding. All right, because the scripture says that that wisdom and knowledge shall shall uh, you know increase in Daniel the twelfth chapter. And that's that's how this knowledge has increased. All right. So hey, this is this is a quick lesson. I think I'm I gotta get some gas. I think I'm running out of gas. So Lord, we'd like to get to a gas station, but. Uh, you know, and Lord, with this lesson was edifying. I want to give all honor, glory, and infinite worship to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rafaha, Kodash, Lalam Young. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. I want to say Kwame Sharala, Mawak, Lava Paul, Shalom.